Hey, how you doing? How you doing? It's your girl Lauren, and welcome back to the podcast. Today we got an all girls panel. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, so go ahead and introduce yourselves. <laughs> I thought we were gonna go in like order or something. No, okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I'm Chanel. Yeah, that's not, like you didn't give me. This. <laughs> I mean, I'm Chanel. I mean, yeah, I'm a graduate of FSU. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Okay. 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 Hello, everybody. I am Nas. I'm a um, junior here at FSU. Hi, I'm Tamiko, and I'm a junior as well. So. Yeah. Two grads, two juniors. <laughs> Old as dirt. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right, so today's topic is how do you deal with a long-distance relationship? You don't. Nah. <laughs> nah, I ain't going to hold you. I agree with uh, I can't do it. I can't do yeah, it. I've done it before. How long did it last? Mm, not. I mean, it lasts like a few months, but... Yeah, no. Like, how mm. far were y'all apart? Yeah. Well, one time they was living in New York. God. Mm. Oof. That didn't even last. <laughs> 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 and then the other time, it was just like, it lasted like a few, like, really like a few months after that. But, I mean, it only depends on, like, trust and, like, mm. yeah. yeah. what y'all tell each other, to be honest. Mm. Me, I was just working. Because I can't be thinking about y'all all day and you're not here. Right. That's true. true. That's true. I say if I can't get my hands on you, it's no point. Yeah, Especially but I mean it's never. Um, I mean I feel like if y'all can, uh, like, make a travel situation, like if y'all agree on something as far as like traveling situations, then it should be, it shouldn't be a problem. Me personally, I don't know. I just feel like it would for me as far as like being in one. It would depend on, of course, like the actual distance, like how far we are from each other. And then also just, like, how you said, like, trust and everything. Cause yeah. That's a real big thing, I would say. Like, just being Especially able to Especially the travel stuff. Fly mm-hmm. me out, then. <laughs> <laughs> we got the money to be doing all that. Right. That's crazy. That's why they're going to fly true. you out. They're going to fly you yeah, yeah, yeah. out. <laughs> no, that's okay. <laughs> that's true. I can understand trust. Like, if you trust that person, that they ain't going to do nothing shady. Yeah. But at the same time, like, what proof do you have? Exactly. That's what Even I'm if they do something shady. Mm. Mm. That's why I also say, like, the distance plays, like, a big part. Because if you're not that far, then, I mean, like, it's it's no issue to, like, you know, keep, like, travel or whatever. But as far as, like, if you across the world and I just got to trust you just nah. off of what you're saying. Yeah. Nah. No. <sighs> At max, I'll nah. do four hours. Like, me driving to D.C. I could do that because I got mm-hmm. family in D.C. Okay. But if you in, like... New Orleans, Texas, Nevada, somewhere. Mm-mm. Yeah. No. Nah, that's that's not it. Mm-mm. It's a vacation after that. Yeah. <laughs> Practically. <laughs> right. A little sneaky link when I'm it, in town. Exactly. Right. Literally, like, yeah, that's yeah, all yeah. it can be because a Ain't whole no relationship. It, yeah. I don't see. I know people that be doing it, but. It be a lot that be um, coming out and they get together and they actually be together, move together, move in together. But, yeah. I mean, the way life's set up right now. <laughs> broke man, broke man. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> so, like, mm. at one point, okay. So, say y'all together for like a month versus a year. At what point can you? Oh lord! <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> I see. I my phone with that one. <laughs> Bam. Okay. So, how? At what time span can you all be together? For you all to, like, how can I word it? All right, so y'all together for a month or a year. Mm-hmm. And y'all in y'all adulthood, and he get a job in, like, Texas. But you're in, like, D.C. or New York. Mm-hmm. How long can y'all be together before you'll be like, this isn't going to work? When we've been together for, like, just a month or a year? Yeah. Okay. I feel like if you if we've been together for a year and we already established like a foundation that we were to get like we were together at one point like in the same area and we've already been together for a year and then like you go and get a job or whatever in Texas I feel like that shouldn't it would be I feel like it would take me like a little bit 
before I can just say, like, okay, like, I can't do this anymore. Because I just feel like, like I said, we've already built that foundation. We've already been around each other. So it's not like a situation where you're already in Texas and then we decide to talk to each other all the way across, you know, the country. Right. And stuff. But, um, yeah, I just feel like if you, like, how you just said, you, you're moving to Texas to get a job, obviously. So, I mean, who says that we can't eventually – both be in Texas, if that makes sense. Like, you know, I can't come down there and get a better job, get a better opportunity or whatever, and we both still make it work together. But I feel like for that to happen, if it's, like, longer than, I would say, anything, like, past, I would say past a year, that would be, like, okay, like, what are we doing here? Like, So basically, like, take the job, but, like, down the line, if you want to really be with me, you will come. Yeah. And mm-hmm. live with me where I'm at. I mean, mm-hmm. I got myself set up. You yeah. got to get yourself set up. I mean, it's not hard to find a job somewhere else. Exactly. I mean, it's hard to find a job, but you know what I mean. Like, yeah. exactly. it's all about, like, know, it could be better opportunities for you there, like, for me as well. So, you know, it's never the, um, just basically, like, you know, never say never type thing. Because if we already were together and we already been together for that year, who says that we still can't, like, can't make it work and eventually both just move to a different place and both like establish something else in like you know texas or wherever right. but you know that's why i just said it was just or north carolina be, i mean yeah. hey you know, <laughs> yeah. i'd be a little scared though just because like um if i was established in my career mm-hmm. and then they had their career but they had to move away i'd be like mm. Yeah. I'm gonna yeah. stay here for me, like, cause at the end of the day, I have to <clears throat> worry about myself. So right. if we're not engaged or anything, like, mm-hmm. I just have to see. I agree with that. Yeah, especially if, if you messed up. If I get yeah. up and unroot myself for right. you, exactly, and like two, three months in, something happens, right? right. Exactly, I'm screwed. Like yep. I'm in a whole nother city, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. taking me out of my comfort. Right. Zone. Yeah. That's also I feel like Don't it has to be a if it was already like a foundation established yeah. and like. Sometimes you might not even have to go all the way down there because if we're already, like I say, if we already met in one place and we've been together for so long, then obviously that means that you have some sort of like roots back where I am. So you're still going to come back to like New York or wherever I'm at because I mean, you might have, you might have family there or whatever. So like, yeah. you know, you can still come back. So like maybe you won't have to move. Maybe I won't have to move all the way to Texas with you. And you know you could just we can both you know take take trips if it's if it's that um, if we both feel like how you said if I'm already established in my career and I I like I'm adamant about not you know wanting to leave then I just like and then I feel like also like as my spouse you should understand that and understand that I already have a career going on and that you're the one that's going to Texas to find better opportunities because you know. Something may not be working for you here, so I feel like if you if you want to commit to me and want to commit to us, then you understand that and just be okay with me, um, you know, staying here since I'm already so far in my career. Like you would, that would be have to that would have to be understanding between both of us, basically. That makes sense. Yeah. But then the moving in together. Like, why would I have to move in with you? That would be my problem, too. It's, yeah. Especially if we were already living apart. Like, then that's yeah. creating a whole well other dynamic. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so. Sleepover. Exactly, <laughs> sleepover. At what point do you move in with each other? Like, before marriage, a certain amount of months or years? Like, mm, I feel like engaged. when I you get, I mean, yeah. like, you be engaged. Like, I mean, I gotta feel like I gotta know who I'm living with for yeah. a minute, and yeah. then if we engage, okay, uh-huh. we might be putting stuff together financially. Mm-hmm. Okay, 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 physically, you know. Yeah, but I gotta know who I'm, who I'm gonna <laughs> right. be with. True. I can't, I can't argue with you to like for maybe like about a year or so, then we move in. No, that's not gonna work because I like, need to like, years. That's fast. That's yeah. That's, that's way saying. too fast. It like, goes by oh, quick. Because <laughs> 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 that's exactly what happened. To me. Uh-huh. <laughs> I feel, well, I guess it depends on both parties. Yeah. If you all trust each other and have adapted to each other's type of living mm-hmm. style, like staying with each other for a certain amount. Yeah. I guess, like, three months, I feel like that's too soon. But, like, six yeah. plus, yeah. if oh. y'all want to move in. Definitely. Y'all can. That's the main key, though. It takes two anyway. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Like, I can't be wanting to be with you, and then you want to be over here sometimes. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I know. Like, if, we, if we together. Yeah. <laughs> let's say we six months in, we together, right? It's like, okay, I might be an introvert, mm-hmm. but you might be an extrovert. Mm-hmm. But you know how I want to be loved and all that. Right. But you don't want to be around me as much. But when you with me, mm. where you at? Yeah. I get what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? I get what you're saying. And that that could also play a part in like long distance relationships mm-hmm. because like you already know we far away and I can't see you, can't touch you, can't do nothing with exactly. you. Yeah. I mean we can cook on FaceTime, but that's not me cooking <laughs> with you. <laughs> like I need to turn around and be like, taste this. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Exactly. I've seen something, like, on TikTok with, like, a couple. They, I guess, like, they're long distance, and they've been making it work by, like, they have, like, date nights on FaceTime. They go to, like, restaurants and, like, be on FaceTime and, like, eating and stuff like that. Or, like, they'll go to the movies and, like, be on FaceTime and, like, make it. But I just, I don't know. I feel like me personally, I'm too. I can't do it. I'm too much of a, like, a touchy person. And it's, like. I'm going to reach over. Like, what I'm supposed yeah. to do? Put my right. arm over the phone. Exactly. Like, I just, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. No, you put the cover over the phone. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. that's not, I don't know, like. Just love languages. I feel like quality yeah. time, physical touch. Yeah, yes. I, those are definitely and major ones. And then there's some people that just can do it. Yeah. 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 And it's the y'all temptation. But then, it's the temptation. That's what I'm saying. It's like, y'all got to be cheating. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, I can't agree got, with that. But yeah. I'm like, with our generation, we have so much technology mm-hmm. that it makes it able for us to do certain things that true, probably true, like true. our parents and grandparents couldn't do. Yeah. Because I don't, my grandma told me, like, she, my grandfather moved to D.C. and she was still, like, in her hometown and they were married. Mm. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, how? Right. That's just trust, and I'm yeah, just like, exactly. with me, no, I'm going to touch you. If I can't touch you, no. No, no. exactly. I can't do it. I feel if like I can't touch you, why are you kissing me? <laughs> <laughs> Please don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm like, I feel like with us, it's a lot of temptation. Exactly. With social media. Yeah, and, it's, yeah. And like, real it's not life. the same. Because even DM it, I feel like that's cheating. Why are you talking to another girl on, like, that type of level? Like, that's messed yeah. up. Yeah, I feel some type yeah. of way. If I, if I, if see, I've seen that. Mm-hmm. But I, I choose ah. happiness. So I ain't going to look at your <laughs> no, phone. Exactly. I choose yeah. happiness. happiness. But if, if, we, if it's 2 o'clock in the morning and we in bed asleep and your mm-hmm. phone buzzing, yeah. you chose life for them. That's what you, <laughs> you put them on the correct path. Yeah. <laughs> no, nah, I don't check phones. I ain't got no reason. If I if I ain't got Ooh, no reason, why am I gonna go find them? Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I, I feel like if you if you bad, look in a phone, you're looking for a reason. Mm-hmm. No, if I'm already in your phone and I'm just like, <laughs> let me go on Instagram or like you know whatever, yeah. and something pop up. He no, came yeah. to me. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. Exactly. Then I'm a dunk it. Yeah. 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 Be like, then they be like, why yeah. you looking at my phone? Maybe your phone came to me. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I yeah, better agree with that. that. I'm trying to figure out who he and is. Right. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I, ooh, I choose happiness. Okay, I just I just started even like if I just don't even pull a phone out around me. I'm just I just look the other way. Just cause no. I used to be a phone checker. I don't do that no more. Once they get to the little, mm, I'll be nosy. Because if you put that phone yeah, out there, so that's what I'm saying. Up. Nope. <laughs> no. Nah, okay. Up. Not yeah, too yeah. much. <laughs> <laughs> I put it face down because I'm tired of seeing it. <laughs> I put my face down. It don't yeah. mean I'm like, hiding I just nothing. do it. Like, nah. out of ju- it just, I just do it put sometimes. Put the phone like, on silent. It might be yeah. faced up or the it might be face still down buzzing. Down there, but there's like no meaning. Behind it, I just do it sometimes. But, but like, see, look, okay, so we talk about long distance relationship, but you mm-hmm. put your phone on D and D. That's what I was. About okay, to say. listen, let's talk about D and D because everybody has that. something to say about D and D. I don't if like they my put their phone on D and D. Listen, listen, if mm-hmm. they put their phone on D and D, no, because listen, yeah. my I phone keep mine on personally, D&D and I can't listen, stand it. My phone has been it. on D and D for about two years faithfully, and I'm not no. lying. What? I cannot yes. stand. I don't the, like the sounds. Like it's not even about like. I'm a press. I don't, notify I don't care. Anyways. You can, notify you can be notified anyways. Because I do no. that to you. I do that to you. Anyways. Yo. I can't. Like, like, I just don't like all those sounds. I did that to her like, Which Exactly. Room? Nah, I did have to do that to you. I'm not going to lie. See? But it was it was just because I had to I know where I was going. Like, I, I keep my phone on D&D for the simple fact. I need to sit down and study. Okay. So, that... 
frame is yeah. when mm-hmm. I put it on D and D. Like it got a set time from like six to nine at night. Okay, All right. But then if I don't feel like being bothered all day, that phone exactly. on D and D. Because like me personally, I'm just crazy. busy for one. Like I'm just, I'm just a <laughs> busy person. So it's like I don't want to be somewhere and like my phone just keep going off. Because like people, people text me all the time. So like I just. Mm-hmm. All the sounds and everything, it's just really annoying, especially, like, when I'm having, like, a really, really busy day. Like, I don't like all that. But that's why I also have, like, some people, people who I know, like, that are my, like, closest friends or, like, important contacts. I have them on emergency bypass so that if they text me, it goes through, like, if they call me, it just automatically goes through Mm -hmm. regardless of the, yeah, Yeah. of the D&D. So that's why I be feeling like I don't need to take... Take my phone off of D and D because it'd be certain people they'd be like, take your phone off D and D. No, you're not. No, you you don't need unless to. you calling me about some money. Uh, yeah, <laughs> unless you calling me with a purpose or texting me with a purpose, then yeah. no. But Y'all like, funny because I ain't I never can't. put my phone on D and D. Never. I just really? put it on silent and hold yeah, it. Just best, do it once. But it's so, the phone so be going peaceful. crazy. Yeah. It is so peaceful. But D and D is only because <laughs> I have my MacBook and I be having to do Spanish language labs, and it's annoying because the tutors will look in your phone and notifications pop up. So anybody, you can see whatever they say. And I'm like, nah, I need to put do not disturb on because they're not about to be checking <laughs> be my messages. y'all connected to y'all laptop, connected to y'all phone, I know. connected oh, to yeah. y'all TV, yeah. and all oh, that yeah. pop up on all surfaces. That's too much. It does. It's giving it emails. It's, it's wild because <laughs> I have a MacBook and then I yep. got my smart TV. So my yep. phone is connected to my MacBook mm-hmm. and my TV. Mm-hmm. Girl, they watching you. Oh, they done got my. They oh, done definitely. seen. They done yeah, yeah, seen yeah. some stuff. They seen like, a lot well, of stuff. Heard it's a lot on the of black stuff. Black web now. Run me my check. It is what it is. Maybe I'm gonna I stick to it. um my phone <laughs> and auto sync to my email. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that auto sync to profiles. That's enough for me. That's enough. But what is auto sync to profile? Like Uh-oh. to like only like certain profiles They're you have. Advanced. They'd be like, can you auto sync your contacts or something? <laughs> Ew, no, I don't want I don't my like contacts to knowing that I be oh, on this. Oh, yeah, no, I be turning no. that off. No. I hate and that'd be that. crazy because mm-hmm. you know what's what's up. Facebook is crazy. So if y'all yes. boo up there, long distance, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and they got your login. Yeah. Oh, it's Auto so <laughs> yeah. Who was Felicia? Yeah. August twenty eighth. Nah. Uh, uh. Two thousand eighteen. <laughs> babe, we wasn't. We, babe, we wasn't even together. No, it don't mm. matter. That's but we was point. talking. <laughs> That's yeah, a good point. Mm-hmm. Talking. Would you get mad at your significant other for talking to people in the past? Yes. Oh wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Um, in a funny way, because um, this guy I was recently talking to, uh, we had came from a kickback from his house, and the girl in the car, she was like, oh, yeah, he had did it with my cousin, blah, blah, blah. See, At the time, listen, see. I did not, I didn't know. It's I was the like, family member. We're not going to keep talking. So wow. I was like, it's fine. Keep it but then the when family. I started thinking about it, I was like, so why did you, why did you mess with her cousin? Now I'm thinking, I'm like, hmm. But we weren't talking then, but I just think that's funny. But now I got to see him. <laughs> but now it's the that, fact at like, the family right. reunion oh. at church, your cousin like I get that like we in college so everybody yeah. rotates. I swear basically. to God, mm, not God. me. Okay. <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying? Oh my no. gosh. Okay. Okay, guys. Say your outro real quick, and then I'll just. Unfortunately, I have to leave. I have a very oh. important Same meeting. Um, sadly, unfortunately. So, um. It was very nice talking with you guys. I will. Uh, I'm glad to come back. Of course, we should yes. definitely yeah. do more podcasts. Yeah, of yes. course. I'm here for it. I like this group. We, yeah. we real you guys funny have nice voices. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I so. like this mic though. Yeah, know, this, right? this mic. This how I sound on the phone. It's really good. Right. <clears throat> Is this what I be sounding like? Good night. <laughs> Buenos noches. <laughs> Tag y'all. Say y'all names and then say y'all Instagrams, or social medias. Ladies first. We all. Oh, like, like, <laughs> <like, go ahead. laughs> You go first. Oh, I went first last time. Okay. Um, so, again, my name is Tamiko, um, and you can find me on Instagram at TamKiki, double Y, and, yeah. Y'all see why my name is TamKiki. <laughs> 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 okay, guys. I'm Nas, and, uh, yeah, you guys can follow my Instagram at I-L-U-V-N-A-S-S-S, three S's. S-S-S. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I know who it is. It's Chanel. You know, follow me Ooh, on Instagram at nope. c.vix underscore. I see you there. Y'all already know. It's your favorite person. <laughs> Lauren, for real. With yeah. a Y. With a Y. Not an E. Oh, not an E. Uh-oh. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But I hope you guys. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> that was exciting. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed today's podcast. I got my girls, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Bye. 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 Oh, Ooh, I wish I would have came sooner rather than later. You had yeah. one job. <laughs> I had Walmart deliver my groceries. Oh, you, you know they take forever. Huh? You did you drive over here or you walked? I drove. Oh. You take me to the... Uh, I got you, babe. I got to... Oh, damn, drive. Jesus. I, oh, God. Damn.